Lab2 computers will be delivered with a lot of educational content. This introduction will explain some of the documents and material we reach out for schools and refugee projects. So here we uh, will find the desktop, the made desktop in our case. When you open uh, the Firefox browser, you will find predefined tabs with educational content. This can either be Wikipedia selection for schools, which is available in several languages, in this case in English, or the more complete uh, Rachel collection, which as well comes with Wikipedia for schools, but as well with documents for mathematics, science, healthcare, agriculture, literature and much more. Also in close there is uh, an English language course with grammar book, documents and audio and video lessons and a picture dictionary which uh, will explain by pictures new vocabulary, uh, new words. And uh, you will find wikis also offline. All you have seen so far is offline on a computer, so you don't need any internet connection. Here you will find documents for uh, technical information. And this page, of course, will not run when you are offline. This is a typical uh, search engine access. and. Then there can be optional content like African storybooks in various uh, languages like English, but also in um, African languages. You will find all these information on our web server. This can either be our FTP server. So here we offer a lot of content um, in archives, so it's very easy to download them, unzip them to the public folder and they're ready to be used. There's Rachel content uh, for Germany. We collected several content for refugees, a Wikipedia for schools in several languages and Xova wikis we upload on, re on if you demand a new language we prepare an archive for this language and you will find here ready to download um, several wikis i will explain so far in a minute you will find all this information also in web so um, in case you want to upload individual educational content, you are free to do so, but please make sure that, uh, that you don't violate any rights, any legal rights or licenses. Xova is a very powerful tool for offline wikis. There are more than 800 wikis available. Uh, when you get a lab new computer, there should be um, a simple English uh, version pre-installed, which is um, in a very compact way uh, and in very easy English, uh, the Victionary, Wikibooks for children, young adults or adults, uh, you can read and learn, uh, Wikiquote and a Victionary if you want to learn foreign languages. You can uh, start to download either using our FTP uh, server but also uh, you can uh, download from web there is an online import uh, we recommend the offline import because uh, you should download version 2 of the wikis because they come with pictures uh, the online uh, comes without any pictures but you can add them later uh, by using this version 2 or use offline import and import with pictures from the beginning. Um, all these documents 
are kept in a special folder. When you open the file browser, you will find typical structure for documents, picture, music, videos, etc. There's one special folder, the public folder. Uh, the content stored in this folder uh, is made available for every user on the computer. Uh, here you find manuals, how to start, uh, manuals about LibreOffice and Ubuntu in various languages. So we collect them, everything is available for free um, and it's very helpful to, to go through this document. Video tutorials, the wiki folder with the several wikis in several languages and the Xova wikis are kept in this folder. So I hope I could give you an overview and there are other tutorials for education software and more. So if you have more suggestions, if you are aware of more educational content, please send us a mail to the project team and we will check that and if it's uh, useful we will add it to our project. Thank you very much.